we'll go to the project demonstration of e waste aggregation using uh, raspberry pi and uh, updating the data through iot into the web link so here we have interfaced the pi camera along with ir sensors to the raspberry pi 4 model here we are using updated version and uh, next we are going to drive the servo motor and the dc motor and we are going to show the status on the 16 by 2 lcd screen so here the operation is like whenever any object is placed on this conveyor belt the object is nothing but these four kind of PCBs. We have developed the data set for these four kind of PCBs and that uh, will be detected by the IR sensor. We have placed one IR module here. So this is the IR module which will detect the object which is coming on this conveyor belt and once the object is detected so Raspberry Pi will take a decision to stop the rotation of this uh, DC motor and then there is a one Pi camera. So here we can see the Pi camera along with lighting and based on the lighting and pi camera it will capture the image and it will check with the database so once the object is found in the database then the system rotates this servo motor here we have attached one servo motor that is the mg995 servo motor so this is the wire connections for the servo motor so here we have a place like this slot is for the mobile phone so so we have this is the mobile phone pcb and uh, this one is the calculator pcb and uh, this one is the wi-fi and this is going to be the Bluetooth. So calculator, Wi-Fi, sorry, this one is the Wi-Fi and the Bluetooth and mobile phone. So Raspberry Pi will provide the angle of rotation for the servo motor whenever the particular object is identified and that particular object will be placed in this uh, blocks and also we are going to update the same information in the browser. So for that, before switching on these kits, we need to enable the hotspots. So go to hotspot settings of your phone and uh, change the hotspot name to 4959 project, project 4959 without any space, without any capital letter. I am repeating PROJECT 4959 and the password should be 129. So then on the hotspots, right. So after switching on the hotspot, you can install one application that is network analyzer some mobile phones doesn't show the IP address so for that purpose we need to install this network analyzer application to check the IP address of our Raspberry Pi model so now after enabling the hotspots provide the power supply for this Raspberry Pi this adapter for the Raspberry Pi model and this is power supply for the DC motors along with servo motor power supply right you can see the the lighting got switched on right so now it will take some time for booting once the booting was successfully done then there will be a welcome message on the LCD screen right so it will go to the zero position now it is zero so place this box in the same direction this arrow mark and this arrow mark now so you can see the do land scan so we get the IP address of 192.168.43.25 enter the same IP address in Google Chrome say 192.168.43.25 colon 5000 so we got this page now everything is 000 so let us place the object so I am placing one object here so there you can see one line is there so the PCB should not cross this line right so once I detected it stops and on the LCD we can see the scanning so Wi-Fi so it plays in the Wi-Fi box Right, you can see that it was placed in the Wi Fi box, and after that, it will keep on rotation. So now we can see that. So the Wi Fi got updated. So if we place it again, so one more is if you remember that. So while we placing that in the same direction, same direction, arrow marks towards us, arrow marks towards the rotation of this belt. model Wi-Fi so place on the Wi-Fi 
you can replace the page to get the Wi-Fi model to PC page. So today power fluctuations sometimes so happens, but right, it's calcul calculated. Right. So there is a power plug something is going on, so then you can re-change that. Place it properly, follow the line, that's very important. Let us see this. Sorry. Place it in wrong direction. Let us see. That's what's wrong. This is actually correct position. This arm should follow that. Right. So it is Bluetooth. So actually, it is mobile phone. Check this. So this mobile phone or data. Right. So only the main thing is lighting <coughs> will play the major role as well as the position of the object, how we are going to placing at this conveyor belt. In this manner, we should place that. It's not supposed to cross this side. 